Types of Cybersecurity Cybersecurity is a critical topic that needs to be taken seriously. In this video, we will discuss the different types of cybersecurity and what you need to do to protect your computer or network from being hacked. We will also discuss some simple steps to boost your security posture. Make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss any future videos on this vital topic. Let's start! Different Types of Cybersecurity Don't let your business be a victim of cyber attacks. Implementing cybersecurity measures will ensure that you and your business won't become a target. Why Cybersecurity is Important we can't remain complacent when it comes to our privacy and security. Now that cyber attackers are becoming more innovative and users have more than one device, it can be a challenge to protect people and businesses from cyber threats. Understanding the reasons why implementing security measures is important not only for our business to remain protected but also for each person's private information can be kept secured. Types of Cybersecurity and AMP Definition 1. Network Security Network security is the process of safeguarding your data from unauthorized entry through your computer networks. Network security includes software and hardware technologies and ensures your security from a variety of threats. It acts as a wall between your network and malicious activity and as an organization, you want to protect your network so you can constantly deliver services to meet the demands of your employees and customers. Generally, protecting your reputation as a business. Here are the types of network security. Firewall. This can be software, hardware, or both. A firewall acts as a barrier between your trusted internal network and external network. Email security. Emails are among the most common gateways for a security breach. Email security prevents any incoming attacks to prevent loss of sensitive data. Antivirus and anti-malware software. Anti-malware scans malware upon entry, monitor files for anomalies, and remove it to fix any damage. Application Security The applications you use to run your business might contain vulnerabilities that can expose and infiltrate your network. Application Security patches these vulnerabilities and prevents any breaches. Data Loss Prevention As business owners, you want to ensure your staff doesn't send sensitive information outside of your network. DLP prevents users from sharing, uploading, or forwarding critical information in a risky manner. 2. Information Security Information Security or InfoSEC is the process of designing and deploying tools to safeguard your critical business information from destruction, disruption, and alteration. It is a crucial factor in cybersecurity where it is specifically designed for data security. The main objective of InfoSEC is the confidentiality, integrity, and availability CIA, of your business data. It is created to guarantee that only authorized users, apps, or systems can access certain information. Here are the types of information security. Cloud security. Mainly focuses on the vulnerabilities coming from internet services and shared environments. It protects the application and infrastructure security from cloud-connected components. Cryptography. This is a process of obscuring content to secure information and only the user with correct encryption key can access the encrypted data. Cryptography retains the confidentiality and integrity of data in transit and storage. Vulnerability Management. This type of InfoSEC is a process where it scans the environment for any weak spots, such as unpatched software. For growing businesses that are constantly adding new users, applications, or updates with infrastructure, this is an important factor to monitor potential exposures. Incident Response A role where it monitors and probes possibly malicious behavior. To contain threats and ensure that your network can be restored, an incident response plan is essential. Also, this preserves evidence for possible prosecution and further prevents breaches. 3. End User Behavior You, as a user, should know your role when it comes to cybersecurity. Users are the first line of defense against cyber attacks. Many security issues can be addressed and prevented by users. Knowledge and education on security best practices will help your organization to avoid exposure to any type of cyber threat, especially now that we live in a digital world where we are always prone to cyber attacks. 
Allow your business to have proper security awareness training where you can cover different threats, phishing scams, device security, password creation, physical security, and more. 4. Infrastructure Security It is a security measure where it protects critical infrastructure, such as network communications, data centers, servers, or IT centers. The goal is to limit the vulnerabilities of these systems from corruption, sabotage, or terrorism. Business owners and organizations that rely on critical infrastructure should understand the liabilities and ensure the protection of the business against it. Cyber criminals can aim at your utility systems to attack your business, so evaluate how it can affect you and develop a contingency plan. Other critical infrastructure includes Power supply and transmission systems Water supply Cooling system Heating and air circulation here are some ways the human factor can increase your cybersecurity risk. Personally identifiable information, most employees should understand the need to keep personal browsing, like shopping and banking tasks, to their own devices. But everybody does a bit of browsing for work, right? Emphasize the importance of keeping an eye on what websites may lead to others. And, that includes social media. Karen in customer service may not realize that sharing too much on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, etc., like personally identifiable information, is just one way hackers can gather intel. Backups and updates, it's fairly easy for an unsavvy tech consumer to go about their daily business without backing up their data regularly and updating their system's antivirus. This is a job for the IT department. The biggest challenge here is getting employees to understand when they need your help with these items. Physical security for devices, think about how many people in your office leave their desks for meetings, gatherings, and lunch breaks. Are they locking their devices? Highlight the need to protect information each and every time a device is left unattended. You can use the airport analogy. Airport staff are constantly telling us to keep track of our bags and never leave them unattended. Why? Well, because you just don't know who is walking by. Encourage employees to protect their devices with as much care as they protect their baggage. After the description of different types of cybersecurity, we can say that no one is safe from any kind of cyber attack. So, it becomes very essential for every company to have a layered defense system for their network security. Moreover, hiring a reliable cybersecurity firm can also help you keep your systems protected against online threats. I hope you guys surely like and enjoy our video, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for upcoming videos. Thanks for watching.